You're about to see thousands of blue corduroy jackets in downtown Indianapolis. Not that they'll need them in these temperatures, but it is the signature True. site of the National FFA Convention. News 8's Hernan Gutierrez joins us live inside the convention center downtown. Uh, visitors by the thousands, correct? Yeah, that's right. The FFA says more than 70,000 people, FFA members, exhibitors, and teachers are going to be descending upon downtown Indy over the next week. Here to tell us a little bit more, we have some FFA students from all across the country. We have Josie, Eli, Afrifa, and Edwina with us this morning. And Josie, I'm going to start with you. We bonded a little bit before we went on air. We were both speech kids. You're doing speech with FFA. I didn't, wasn't participated that way. But tell me a, a little bit about what you do, where you're from, and uh, what you're looking kind of looking forward to about competing here at national convention yeah absolutely um i'm josie from the state of ohio and this week i'll be competing in the extemporaneous speaking competition um where we actually find out the topic we'll be speaking on just 30 minutes um before we are in presented in front of an audience so i'm super excited to meet the other members and competitors from across the nation this week um and just see what topics i'm drawing have you ever thought about becoming a reporter you know what a little bit we're always recruiting. Yeah. <laughs> Eli, Afrifa, Edwina, I'm going to ask you guys all the same thing. Let me know uh, where you guys are coming from and then just kind of what you guys are looking forward to this week. Yeah, I'm coming from Tennessee, and I think I'm most excited to have fun in the sessions. I'm from Florida, and I'm most excited for the new people I get to meet. I'm from Delaware, and I can't wait to see all your smiles. <laughs> and Afrifa, you mentioned to me that this is your first time coming to National Convention. What kind of uh, pushed you to come? So I'm a state officer this year, so I get the chance to um, just hang out with 60,000 members in the state of Florida for FFA. So I now get the chance to come to National Convention and just, you know, hang out with everybody, you know, be a delegate. So that experience has definitely brought me here to become a national. All right, guys, thank you so much for your time. We really appreciate it. Everything officially kicks off at noon tomorrow. It'll run through Saturday. Reporting downtown, I'm Hernan Gutierrez, for TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.